This is Dr. Mark Vaughn, Dr. Arisoft of Arisoft Medicine, here in Las Vegas at SHOT Show 2011, talking with Jackie Pong, the CEO and President of Classic Army. Thank you for granting us this interview. Yeah, you're welcome. Classic Army, as I understand it, has been pretty much Classic Army for years. But I understand that there's partnerships with some people outside of the company, for example, Krebs products that are coming out. Are there other partnerships on the horizon? The plan is to take the Classic Army products to a higher level. That is by listening to its end users and consumers and dealers and whatnot in focusing in on what are those popular models, whether it be a Krebs, the B Knight's Armament, whatever the company may be, they want to grab those licenses. There seems to be quite an um, excitement about gas blowback rifles. Uh, a lot of the other manufacturers are starting to do that more and more. Is it possible there'll be a gas blowback, classic, gas blowback classic army rifle in the near future? Currently, um, they're working on it, and it's definitely in the works, and it's coming. Can you tell us which particular model? For now, M4s. All right. Uh, actually, it's interesting. They're actually revising the gas system. Uh, can you give any more details as far as how it's going to be modified from the existing system? Their philosophy is that gas weapons are affected by atmospheric conditions. Usually when it's cold, it's no good. So they're trying to perfect a system that can be really truly all weather without affecting the, the rate of fire, you know, the pressure, etc. So it's quite interesting that they're using a little bit of you know, science. So would that mean using a different gas than green gas, red gas, or CO2? He would like to use CO2 more. What other things do we see on the horizon with Classic Army with these changes you've made? Uh, you, you've talked a little bit about the models that are, are more popular, uh, possibly a gas gun. Are there specific models that aren't out now that you can tell us about? Um, he's looking at obviously the Krebs models. Um, they have um, uh, an eye on Knights, they're working on an LMG. Um, they're looking at the future M110 and also they're wanting to do a gas PDW. Anything new as far as pistols? Um, Sidearms and pistols aren't a big focus right now, but they would like to obviously revisit that down the road a bit because there is a market. Um, and since their you know, knowledge and what they put out produces mainly rifles, they can kind of stick to that formula right now. Is Classic Army doing anything as far as a campaign or a uh, a goal of increasing the safety of airsoft. The airsoft sport is a leisure sport, and it should be considered a sport that could be, you know, had for younger kids, older adults. But the issue of safety remains the same. No matter how old you are, you can still get hurt if improperly used. So, at a, at a manufacturer level, they're trying to look at bringing that also towards the distributor to help obviously support um, this issue of safety so that it could be, for example, we could do a video on the Classic Army site about safe play, safe handling. And the idea is to promote the airsoft gun as a true leisure product. Any final message about the direction that Classic Army is going that you'd like to get out to all the airsoft community in the United States and beyond that's uh, going to be listening to this interview? It's their job to really start promoting the sport in a big way. I want to keep continuing to make product for people to enjoy, to have great product, great pricing, but at the same time promoting the sport of airsoft to let it grow for future generations. They're very happy and pleased to be a part of sort of making that the generation of toys for the public. And he wants to make more to continue that for the future. Great. Thank you very much. Thanks, Jackie, for joining us for this interview. We appreciate having you. We're glad that you came out to SHOT Show to see us and uh, came out to the United States to see all the airsofters that we have out here. And we'd also uh, like to let all of our viewers know that you can get more information like this at airsoftmedicine.com, where we like to deliver all the best information about airsoft safety and protection that you can find. Until next time, this is Dr. Airsoft saying, play safely.